Go, 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 go. It's your favorite house. It's your girl, Queen D of Queen D Live Experience. Welcome to another edition. I'm always so excited to bring y'all a new episode of the Queen D Live Experience. I have so much going on. Um, you know how you got so much going on, you can't talk really. You can't breathe. You can't talk. <laughs> There's so much going on. It's like every corner I turn is something, something, something. It's good something, but it's a lot going on. I want to talk first about this weekend's event that's coming up, RevUpNation.com. Um, it's an event um, by Ken James. It's his vision, his baby. He is putting on one of the most biggest e events Um Ooh, I've ever, I've, I haven't been to one of these in a while, like a huge event with a concert, with a kids event, crawfish festival, it's several things and it's all in one weekend. So um, we got a, uh, I'm so excited that we'll be doing that this weekend and being a part, major part of that event. And um, we got a lot going on and I'll be hosting along with a beautiful lady by the name of Tiffany. Uh, she will also be hosting the red carpet with me. We are the premier red carpet hostess. And um, this event, it has Miss Kelly Price and Life Jennings as special guests um, on the evening of the Grown and Sexy Night. Grown and Sexy Night. <laughs> I'm excited about that. I'm, I'm listen. I've never, ever, ever met Kelly Price on this journey yet, but I I love her. I love her music. I love what she represents. I love everything about her. I know that she has been through <coughs> quite a few things over this journey, and I'm looking forward to syncing with her, and um, hopefully I'll get an exclusive with her and Life Jennings. Um, again, we are hosting the red carpet for the entire weekend. It's going to start with a kids event, kids festival, then go into grown and sexy evening with a major big concert with other artists and Life Jennings and Kelly Price. And the last night, it will be a crawfish festival. So we'll be in Houston all weekend, guys. Um, I'll be out there repping my book, Queen Z Media Course, The Journey. Let me show you all that really quick. This is my media memoir. You guys know I wrote a book. I wrote several books last year. Um, and this is one that speaks on, you know, what has happened over the journey of me being in media. It's a special memoir. <clears throat> and I'll have it this weekend in Houston, um, including stories with Bushwick Bill, my exclusive with Taraji Henson, plus more. So much more in here. Also, we selling our shades. Hey, I don't know if y'all um, <laughs> um, are, you know what I mean, going to be in the, the area this weekend, but definitely we got to, you know, you got to get out there. Let me see if I can find the information so that we can go ahead and get this um, information put up. Sorry, y'all, about this yawning. Shouldn't be yawning. My goodness. I don't know why my, um, my live is not syncing. My um, guest is supposed to get on in a few minutes, but it's, it's, having a connection issue. I don't know. This is also, what is that that they call where all the technology is just going crazy? I can't think of that phase. Or Hold on a second, y'all. I got to get me a bottle of water. What do they call it? Mercury? What do they call it? Uh, retrograde? Something, something. Well, all the technology goes crazy. We're in that phase. So I wouldn't be surprised if this doesn't sink. It's been sinking all this time. I never have any issues. But for some reason today in particular, it is not 
connecting. Let me see if I can send out um, a message to my guests. This special guest is amazing and powerful. My husband actually met him on his route, his work route. And um, that was really cool. And even my, I'm not even getting any views. So that's interesting too. Hold on, y'all. I don't know what's happening with this live right now. But we gonna get it together sometime today. <laughs> Let me tell my guest that he can use any. I don't know why it's not working. I usually. I usually don't have any issues with getting my guests on here, but I don't know what's happening right now. I pray that uh, everything works out. This gentleman, um, we met when my husband was on his route and um, sometime destiny is destiny and you sync with people. He was just an amazing guy and had great energy. And my husband connected with him and got his contact. Now he's going with us. Uh, to Houston this weekend and he will be working with us but just that quick just that quick destiny is destiny guys and you just never know why you meet people who what you know what I mean uh, things like that so we literally are trying to get them on another Thank you for turn, tuning in, Precious. Thank you for tuning in. Ooh, y'all have no idea. I can't wait till I see them light up so we can get them on the show. Because I want to get their perspective. He's there with some friends who um, have a nonprofit organization, and they're going to be talking probably, too, um, about what they do and what they, you know, have. What's up, Picasso? You know, I had you on the show the other day. So happy that you're here tuning in. I'm actually waiting on my special guest, so I'm kind of burning time. Um, but how about how about the other day that my babies brought them straight A's in? How about that? On top of all this crazy year that we had. Um, I was super, uber, uber excited and tripped out by that because we had a year. And even including, you know, them um, having to not be in school for a season and then they went back to school and then they had to go to school virtually. I didn't know if it was working. It was just a bunch of frustrations of this past year. And um, when they brought them report cards in here, I could not believe it. I was in shock. I was like, wow, really straight A's? Only one of them got an S for satisfactory, but the rest were E's, and E's mean A's when it comes to uh, report card language, and it, it's, um, it was excellent, excellent, which is an E, and I was like, my God, you are good to us, because I, I can't, I don't even know how we did it, how we all did it. I traveled, I got so much stuff that I had to do this past year. <laughs> I was working on goal after goal after goal after goal. So I guess while I was working, they were busy too, getting their education and getting them books and hitting them books and things like that. So um, I'm just so happy that my babies chose to uh, get, you know, focused this year and get on the ball and get them books. You know what I mean? I'm just so happy for them. Your life is echoing. It's echoing? That is so weird. What is going on with this live tonight? 
my Wi-Fi is fine, like normal. I'm, I don't usually have any issues with my Wi-Fi. Um, let me try to go in from another device. Maybe I'm having an issue with my tablet. I don't know. I'm going to enter from a whole nother device and see if that helps. Y'all hang tight. What do they call that that era in time when just technology don't work? Is it retrograde? What is that era? This I think we're in the middle of retrograde or whatever they call it. <laughs> I think we're in the middle of that moment, so I don't know what's going on. Uh, my tablet is charged. Yes, it is, Key. It really, really is. Uh, yeah, but, okay. I'm trying to see if I can get into my own live from another device and see if that's going to work. Because I don't know what's happening. My laptop is completely dead. Yes, it does. It really does. Teamwork does really make the dream work. Let's see. Okay, let's see. I'm trying. I'm telling my guests that I'm trying to log in from another device too. I don't know what's going on. Well, what's happening? But we ain't finna. We ain't about to give up. Y'all know I don't give up on nothing. <laughs> and we try everything. Okay. He's trying to hook up his computer. Normally, I don't have any issues with this, but I don't know what's happening tonight. And they give me full access into studio. Y'all hang tight. Thank you for, um, you know, being patient with my technology issue. <laughs> and I usually have my uh, producer on deck. Let me see if I can access her real quick. I know I'm, I'm calling at the last minute. Oh, here you go. Oh, that's me. I see me popped up there. Let me tell them when I tried to enter, it works. Um, y'all hang tight. My bad. I'm sorry. Y'all seeing some real, <laughs> real deal right now. <laughs> hey, is there any way you can um, just try through your regular cell phone? Because um, I tried it. I tried it for my cell phone and it worked. I saw myself light up and everything. Just try, try that same link from your cell phone. You guys are seeing like raw <laughs> moments right here live. I can't shut the live down, so. <laughs> Remember, hit the top of that link that I sent you in Messenger originally. 
and it should work. And you can use basically any phone, even your friend's cell phone you can use. Yeah, we just tried. Yeah, this is crazy. I don't never have any issues. Like, and I even tried it myself just now and it worked. What's up, uh, 52 Flavors? 52 Flavors is in the building. My promotional team, he in the building. Hey, if we gotta, if we gotta interview you like this, look. <laughs> Old school, right? <laughs> You're backstage. Okay, I don't understand why it's not sinking, though. That is so freaking weird. Because when you go in there, I should see you on here, and I don't, I don't see it. Fifty two flavors. Fifty two flavors been my he been he been hook, he been helping me so much, especially lately. Listen, y'all, it's been it's been crazy, y'all, in a good way. And I have had to access some additional teams and pull them on board to assist me with some of this promotion and things like that. So uh thank you, fifty two flavors, for all that you do. Thank you, paper boy, my boy that does all my flyers and things like that. Um, he did one for this Kelly Price event for this weekend and put. You pressing the um, the original link I sent you right in, um, not the first one, the second one. Remember, there were two links in there. It's the last one I sent you. Let me see. Let me make sure you got the right one. So this is it right here. Boom. And you sent it to your friend's cell phone. It didn't work over there either. That is crazy. All you got to do is press that top link right there. It usually brings you right into the studio. And you, you even on the part where you're supposed to be before I let you in, but it's not sinking. <laughs> I don't get it. Devil is a liar. <laughs> right. You know what? I might just have to do it. Um, shoot. You know what? We about to do your interview intercom style. Don't nothing shut nothing down. Right. <laughs> So um, this is my special guest right here, D-Dub. He's on a conference messenger call. Uh, we have to switch it up tonight because it's just not sinking. My God, I don't know what's happening, but it's okay. Ain't nothing going to stop nothing. So um, D-Dub, tell us what you do, and um, are you in um, some facet of the entertainment industry, or do you have your own business? Tell us exactly what you do, bro. Well, I uh men out of jail and out of trouble and out of the police out of the police Say that uh, whole first line over, cause I I heard the second part, but I didn't hear the first part. <laughs> I want to make sure the people hear everything you say. I have a group of entertainment. It has great spanking entertainment, and it helps keep it helps. I'm trying to help keep the African American males out of jail and put them in the studio to the point where they can express themselves. Oh, okay. So you have. You have a, um, a a business that gives men an alternative in music versus being in jail. Exactly. 
Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. That's dope. That's dope, bro. Nikki, with, Nikki right here is with me, and why we, how we linked up and why we linked up. Because <laughs> she does the same, but I'm a Entail, like, uh, what do you guys do with that event? Is it a fundraiser or for your organization? Yes. All of that is put together by the solution, and we honor all those that have died through crimes and murders, and then we come up with solutions how we can better our communities and change our children' mindset and give them something better to do than uh versus the violence and the crime of the neighborhood that's amazing i just love it already i love what you guys represent and what you're about giving our children um and youth you know alternatives to getting in trouble because what happens the the idle mind is a devil's workshop right that's what they say right do we agree we agree with that too because we know <laughs> How many times have we gotten in trouble from just sitting there and just, you know what I mean, twiddling our thumbs and not having nothing to do? Many times. Like, <laughs> I'm <laughs> is depriving because we're not educating them. Right, right. With that, I can't hardly hear you, Dida. I don't know how you're... Uh, All right, can you hear me now? Uh-huh. Okay, yeah. The thing that we went through in our past, why not, why not, why not educate our youth and let them know, hey, we've been there before. Don't go down this road. You know, it's like it's like a warning. Right. Instead of them getting instead of them getting in jail and robbing and stealing and killing, put them in the studio. Let them in the entertainment period. Let mm -hmm. them express their their voice. We're looking for dancers too. I'm proof for dancers also and entertainers. So y'all come out, you have talent and what we do we use our talents for justice. We're fighting for all those that have lost their lives to senseless crime. And I, too, right. three daughters. I've been fighting for 38 years to get justice for my daughters. And so I've come to this point, and we are coming to the top, and we will change justice. Wow. I, wow, what a sacrifice um, you guys make every single day in what you do. Um, for our society and our youth and our children and you know what I mean, our young people. Cause listen, we we really we have to offer something because you got to think about it. They are our future. They are the ones that are going ahead of us. That's that's whatever tone we set in their lives. That's gonna be our future. You understand? <laughs> and a lot of people don't think about it like that, but we got to. <laughs> Right, right, exactly, exactly. Well, I just, I just love what y'all represent and what you're doing. And you say you're looking for dancers. Yeah, we recruit for the dance team. Uh, like I said, we, we also have a charity basketball event, and we're looking for coaches, uh, volunteers, 
and we pay thirteen dollars an hour for volunteers. So if y'all want to come out and learn how to give back to the community while volunteering, we have a door that is open. And this event is free to the community and the public. Uh, free food, entertainment, and solutions, solutions, solutions. So if you have solutions on how we can change these children's mindsets, even the parents, educate them on changing their children's mindset, please come out and join us. And when is that event coming up? Uh, coming up June 5th. We have a special thing going on this year. All the families, the Tauber family, Floyd family, the we, uh, our Tatiana Jefferson family, all of those families want to come out and share this event with me uh, as we fight for justice and change change people's lives. So I'm trying to get a sponsor to uh, host these people to come out and join with us. So I'm going to keep it up. And we'll talk tonight about possibly maybe even adding some on, um, on location interviews or something um, that we can do live bringing the queen g live experience there um you know what i mean we'll talk we go talk we supposed to be meeting tonight so yeah. i'm excited about that and i got so much y'all get ready bring your notebook i got a whole mouthful to lay on y'all too as well <laughs> definitely no no listen we got to work together as a team and we got to get out there and get this going you know what i'm saying because it's very, very important that uh, we support each other with this. You know what I mean? What time does the event start on the 5th? Uh, it's from 1 to 5. All day. Yeah. 1 to 9. Okay. Okay. That sounds good. My, uh, I think my husband going out of town that day. But you know what I do with the you know, interviews, it's like most times we, we come at the very beginning of an event and do our thing with the interviews, you know what I'm saying? And um, and then we, um, you know, it just kind of sets the tone for the energy for the event. So, but we'll talk again about that tonight. I, I can't wait to sit down with y'all and break bread and, you know what I mean, meet y'all in person. Give us the name of your organization again. It's called Superstore Justice, anything nonprofit organization. All right, and give us a D-Dub. Okay, so we gotta, you know, we gotta do this again, right? Because we had some technology issues today. <laughs> I didn't want to give up on the interview altogether. I'm like, you know what? I don't care if we gotta put it on the intercom system or whatever we gotta do. We about to make this interview happen. <laughs> we don't let nothing stop us. That's right, and see, that helps the children also because they see us being challenged, but we did what? We came up with solutions right. to make this happen. And that's what I'm talking about. That's how we're going to change uh, America in the world around is you have to come up with solutions that's positive. Right. To make it work. Any means necessary. That's what I say. <laughs> give us y'all uh, website again. Well, my website is www.superstarbrand.com. Okay. I'm on Instagram. I'm on Facebook. It's D Dub Prince. I'm on Twitter. It's D capital D lowercase D U B capital P lowercase R I S E. All right. Mine's a simple S J E T O dot org. Okay. 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 Listen, guys. Do you have a telephone number that people can reach you at? Of course. Uh, to get And I want y'all to go into the comment boxes, D Dub, and write those numbers in there too, in case. Okay. People want to, um, you know, get in touch with you guys at a later date or for your organization or to be able to uh, donate something toward the organization as well. We want people to, you know what I mean, open their doors and also give to you guys. So we want to be the outlet 
Uh huh. Whatever they can do to We need that too, right? Yes, yes. <laughs> that's right. That's right. Well, I just love. I just absolutely love y'all spirit. I can't wait to meet y'all in another hour or so. Eddie Bell will be joining us tonight, so uh, I wanted to give you that update. Yep, he'll be joining us. And um, wait till y'all see this location. Y'all gonna be blown away. Mm mm mm. Wait till y'all see it. I can't wait. So we, we got some things to go to the table about tonight. And um, listen, guys, keep doing what y'all doing. Um, Queen G Live Experience definitely supports what you guys are doing out here um, on these streets for the youth and um, making a, keeping a positive message out there and alternatives to them getting in trouble, which is, you know, bringing them and giving them a skill and teaching them instead of uh you know what i mean them getting in trouble and getting out there on them streets so um who wouldn't who wouldn't support that i know i i'm supporting it you know what i'm saying <laughs> all day so so i just absolutely love what y'all represent and um we're gonna we're gonna jump off of this live but i want y'all to go back in and write y'all numbers and, and contact and information in the comment boxes and um we'll share this live out to everywhere okay awesome, awesome. All right. If any, if any, we have any celebrities that want to come out and help the Floyd family, the Tarver family, the uh, Tatiana Jefferson, the Ronald Green family, all those lives that have been recently lost, they want to come out to this event. So if you want to give a big donation and really help America, please, sjeto.org. Love y'all and peace. All right. All right, y'all. Thank y'all so much for being patient with me today. I don't know what happened, but hey, we're going to keep it pushing, right? <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Definitely, and I'll see y'all later, all right? All right. Weren't they just the sweetest? I just love their spirit and energy. And um, here we go again. I don't know what happened tonight. Like, I even tried to get in there and it worked. So I don't know what happened. Sometimes reception is just bad at certain locations. I don't I don't know. But um, we still got them on here to talk about what they do and their organization and things like that. And um, y'all please support people like them that are really, really out there giving back to the community and making, you know what I mean, things easier for our youth and giving them alternatives. We need something like that. I know my son right now turning into a teenager, honey. He is changing. His voice is changing. His attitude, personality, everything. And if you don't catch them when they're at that stage, it's like it really will, you know what I mean, destroy uh, our youth. And, and we got to give them something to do. So thank you all for tuning in to tonight's live. We're going to keep all of these amazing type of lives coming. Listen, keep tuning in to the Queen G Live experience. Watch me also in the mornings at about 6 a.m., 6 to 7 a.m., I do a live and I, I go raw and real and uncut um, walk and talk um, and I talk about real life swoles. So listen, guys, thank you all for all y'all support out there. I appreciate everything that you do on my behalf. Keep watching. Keep uh, keep hope alive. And, and if y'all in the Houston area this weekend, stop through uh, to the One Hope um event that's going on in Houston, Texas. Okay. So, um, we'll be there. I'll see y'all soon. Okay. Peace.